Shadow Cupper is a very fast synchronization software. You drag and drop your source directories and your target directories and you simulate. And on the right side um, it is presented what will happen to which files and in what state they are. For example this file over here is new in the source directory, doesn't exist in the target directory and it says it will be copied. Or for example these files here, they are extra in the target directory and will be deleted. So if we say execute now, it will be executed. But now let's see what we can adjust. We can define backup modes. And this is really interesting about the file backupper. You can define any backup mode that you wish. You can specify for the source directories and for the target directories what will happen to what file state. For example, you can say identical files should be disregarded or should be copied, should be deleted or files that are newer in source and older in target should be copied or if you want should be deleted and the same you can do for the target directories. So these are all the operations you have and these are all the possible file states that they exist. That means you can adjust any backup mode that is thinkable. And here you have two predefined backup modes. One is the incremental and the other one is the synchronization where also newer files from the target can be copied to the source directory. So after you adjust that you just say simulate and execute and your backup is finished. And include and exclude data. Clicking on exclude files and then we can go to our source directory or target directory and then just drag and drop the file that we don't want to include into this uh, box. And then if we say simulate, this file will not appear anymore. Another cool feature of the file backupper is its to-do list. You can, if you click on a file and click and uh, press enter, then you can directly edit the file. Or if you press space, then the file will be opened in the Win Explorer. And of course, if you don't like what you see, you can select the parts that you don't like and just delete them and they will be not executed.